Hi, this is Glenn Wright with Over the Hedgerow. And today I'd like to talk about hydretane. If you've looked at some of our other videos and photos, I've shown that we applied hydretane, which is a moisture manager to our turf here at the farm. And it was a night and day difference in about seven to 10 days. We also applied hydretane to one of our clients' large properties. They have tremendous hot spots because they're on the, uh, on the water, Lake Michigan. There's in a couple of different types of soil. And within, once again, seven to 10 days, it looked like a fairway at Whistling Straits. Gorgeous course here in Southeast Wisconsin. And so I thought we'd try it with annuals. Annuals, as you know, are always a problem. Hanging baskets, especially. Containers are a problem. If they're in the heat, you water them. They're dry later on that afternoon. So I tried, I thought I'd try an extreme situation. We bought these two perennial asters, just one quart containers at the Big Orange Place for $1.99 each. We applied um, uh, hydrotane to the one on the right, this one obviously, and we did that on August 31st. Today is September 26th, I believe. Uh, we just got back from vacation a couple hours ago, so I'm not quite sure what the date is, so it means it was a good vacation. But uh, we did nothing to it other than the first day we watered this one and we watered this one with hydrotain in the appropriate mix. Now you can see by looking at this, this is a treed one, still vegetation. We could plant this and it would still do well. The other one is really dry. You can see it's dried up. Being a perennial, it's extremely dormant now. I don't know if it would come back or not. But if we take it out of the pot, you can see that it is bone dry everywhere. No moisture to be had, virtually weighs nothing. No root development, no healthy white roots. It is like, feels like cork to me or balsa wood. Really bad shape. Now let's take the other one out of the container. What well, the difference when you put these two next to each other? Treated, untreated. Obviously this one's retaining moisture a lot better. Nice healthy roots. Whitish brown. Had we been taking care of this, it would be great. We can, like I said, we can probably put this one in the ground and it'll do fine. But uh, 26 days, no watering. It's been under an overhang here in front of the in front of the house, so there's been no watering at all. This one probably weighs half a pound or a pound. It feels like I just watered it literally, um, and obviously we have not. We've been out of town for 11 days and we didn't do anything for it for the 15 or so days before that. So this is hydrotain. We're obviously going to use this in our containers next year in our vegetable gardens. Uh, cold frame, we're probably going to use it everywhere. It's done great in turf for, for us. I said we had a large property where we had some hot spots in the turf that have always been a challenge in the brown. We'll have the sprinkler system set up on it this fall. It's installed. We just have to get all the connections done. But we applied hydrotain to the turf for one of our clients. No more hot spots, everything's gorgeous and green. Same thing here in the yard. Tried it with these containers and it's just unbelievable to me. I mean, I, you see what vendors supply you with information, but we had to test it for ourselves. So you can get hydrotain on Amazon if you can't get it at your local retailer. It goes under Moisture Manager if, you're, have, if you have a John Deere dealership, if you're a landscape contractor. But hydrotain, uh, you can buy a retail version that a homeowner can use. So I'm impressed. Great product. We will definitely be using it in everything next year. This is Glenn Riker with Over the Hedgerow.